What's up, everybody? It's your boy Ali with Night in the Life. Um, and today we're going to do a, a driver income comparison. Um, who makes more money doing the same amount of work comparing Uber to Yellow Taxis? Okay. So before I get started, before I get started, let me let me clarify one thing. Okay. So now everybody's in this rush to see who can get the cheapest trips, right? So one thing you need to understand as a passenger um, when you're looking to find trips is that there's there's three aspects to driving. There's three aspects to um, a trip and how much it costs. And you can never escape these three aspects. Um, the first aspect is the driver's labor. Like how much labor does it take for the driver to drive you, for example, from Central Park to um, Chinatown, you know, that takes a driver's energy, it takes him his time and his alertness, and he has to physically be present, and he has to physically drive you there, so that's one thing that factors into the cost, how much time is it going to take the driver, the second thing that we have to factor is um, the get, that it costs the driver money to drive you somewhere, so for example, to drive you from Central Park to Chinatown, um, the mileage is going to be the same. How much is it going to, how much is it going to cost in gas money? And second is the driver has to pay for the vehicle. So, so the three things you can never escape is that the driver has to pay for the vehicle. Either he's renting the vehicle or he owns the vehicle. But either way, he's paying for the vehicle. So the driver has to pay for the vehicle. The driver has to pay the gas daily. And the driver has to do the labor to drive you somewhere. So when you start complaining that you want to be driven really far for really low amounts of money, what you're really saying is that you want the driver to uh, pretty much work for slave labor or slave wages or work for nothing. So, so customers need to understand that drivers need to make enough money to survive and pay their bills and they have to pay for the car and they have to pay for gas. That's so that you're never going to escape these two things. Okay, so since I got that out the way, let's let's... What we're going to do is we're going to do a cost comparison. Um, who makes the most money for driving the same amount? And we're going to uh, we're going to be looking at uh, receipts for the Uber trips versus the receipts for the yellow taxi trips. OK, so here we are um, looking at some of the trips. I, when I the, you know, the few days that I drove for Uber, I noticed that I was driving really far and getting like really low amounts of money in a yellow taxi. There's no way. I would have had such a little bit amount of money. And I've been working nonstop. I was and getting I couldn't really put it into words, but I could feel it. So what I did now is I took the receipts from each uh, for, from each trip, and I'm comparing them side by side. Basically, two components of what makes a trip cost what it costs, and that's the amount of mileage you drive and the amount of time that you drive. So... Um, like I said before, uh, Yellow Cab drivers earn around uh, $1 per minute. So um, we're going to compare some trips now. We're going to start with um, we're going to start with a ten dollar Uber trip, right? So a ten dollar Uber trip. Um, this trip was three point eighty eight miles, and it was nineteen minutes, and it was uh, ten dollars and ninety four cents uh, on the Uber side. Um, and in the yellow taxi, let's look at a ten dollar yellow taxi. And this ten dollar yellow taxi was one point six miles, and it was uh, eleven minutes. So uh, you have uh, eleven minutes and one point six miles versus uh, nineteen minutes and three point eighty eight miles for the same amount of money. Okay, so um, we're going to go to the next trip. The next trip is a twelve dollar trip. Um, in Uber, the $12 trip was $12.25, and it was 4.19 miles, and it was uh, 23 minutes in uh, duration. And in a yellow taxi, for this same amount of money, uh, it was 2.6 miles, and it was uh, 12 minutes. So here you have uh, 4.19 miles versus 2.6 miles 
and then you have uh, 23 minutes in Uber versus uh, 12 minutes in the yellow taxi. So you're literally running at about half the amount of money uh, for the same amount of work. Okay? So we're literally running right now about half the money for about the same amount of work. We have a different $12 trip in Uber, which is 4.3 miles and 25 minutes uh, for twelve seventy-five. And here you have 2.6 miles. So it's 4.3 miles versus 2.6 miles. And then 25 minutes versus uh, 12 minutes. So at this point, you're running at about half the money. Um, we have a $13 trip here in Uber, 13.25, 4.37 miles, 27 minutes this trip. And we have a $13 taxi trip, $12.95, which is about $13. And it's 1.8 miles, and it is 12 minutes. So this is telling you what I was saying before about the dollar per minute. You could literally see right here that the yellow taxi is exactly 12 minutes, and it's $12.95. And this one is 27 minutes for uh, $13.25. So there you go. You have about half the money. Um, let's see. We have a... Uh, $16.15 trip in the yellow taxi, 37 minutes, 37 minutes. Now think about $1 per minute, and this is $16, and it's 37 minutes, and it's 4.7 miles, right? And then we're going to compare that to a $17 trip in the taxi, which is 4.5 miles, and it is uh, 11 plus 6, 17 minutes. So 17 minutes. And it's 4.5 miles, and here you have 37 minutes and 4.7 miles. And here you actually have less money. You have less money here for a 37-minute trip than you have for a 16-minute uh, trip. Less money. Um, this trip is 11 plus uh, 6, so it's 17-minute trip. And you have a 37-minute trip, and, they, and, it's about this, and it's less money. It's actually less money. Okay, now if you saw my other video, I talked about um, a trip I got to the Bronx, uh, and it was a $29 trip. In fact, let me put that clip up here. Now, I just dropped this dude off in the Bronx. I took this dude from Brass Monkey. You know what Brass Monkey is in the, in the, in the meatpacking? I took him up from Brass Monkey up to Eagle Avenue in the Bronx, right? $29. Okay, $29. 15 miles, 42 minutes. That's not terrible. 20, okay, so, uh, 42 uh, minutes. So in that trip, it was a $29 trip, and it was 15 miles, and it took me 42 minutes to get there. Right? So uh, $29, and it was 15 minutes, and it was uh, f 15 miles, I mean, and it was 42 minutes to get there. And now, uh, by comparison to the yellow taxi, we have another $29 trip, and it was 6 miles. And it was uh, 11, 21, 31, 29 minutes to get there. So 29 minutes and 6 miles versus 15 miles, which is about double the amount of miles for the same amount of money. So let's look at this Uber trip here. This Uber trip is 31, uh, $31. And it is 23 minutes and it's 19.6 miles, 19 miles. Uh, for $31 and it's also 23 minutes and we have a yellow taxi trip for 31 for $30 and it is 6.3 miles so comparing 6.3 miles to 19 miles $29 versus $31 but I drove half the amount of miles so as, as here you can see 6.3 miles versus 19.6 miles okay so and, and you know even if you go into the smaller trips um, if we go into this, like let's let's look at this trip right here. This trip is uh, this is a a taxi trip, and it's one and a half miles, and it's five dollars and thirty cents, and it took five minutes. Um, and this person was paying to wait. That's probably why you even got to five dollars. But look, look, it's a mile and a half, and you got five dollars and thirty cents. And then you look at this yellow taxi trip, and it's a mile and a half, and I got nine ninety five. So I got nine dollars and ninety five cents for going a mile and a half. And in the Uber trip, I got $5.30 for going the exact, same exact distance, a mile and a half. So you're about half the amount of money. 
Now, in Uber, we don't know how much this person paid in the Uber trip. Maybe that'll be my next video. It's how much to see how much they paid. Um, but uh, I can guarantee you they didn't pay Uber $5. They probably paid Uber 10 or $12. And the driver probably got $12, $5 out of the ordeal. Um, but either way, the driver is making half the amount of money for driving the same amount of time. So this is just a little comparison for today to show you... Um, the earnings of Uber versus Yellow Taxi. And as you could see, uh, if you're an Uber driver and uh, you don't know how much money you should be making per trip, if you're, yellow, if you're a Yellow Taxi driver and you're considering switching to Uber, I would, I would uh, not recommend it because um, they're taking a lot of money. Anyway, that's all for today. I hope this uh, information sits with you well. And I hope we can uh, make some differences in uh, our decisions. All right. Night in the life, driver, writer, photographer, have a good night, peace out.